Black and white Asians, we are one. Black and white Asians, we are one. Yeah. Dr. Ebe Domino to Papa Adeboye and Bishop Oyedepo. Everybody who collects Dr. Ebe Domino is exposing, exposing this, those Nigerian pastors and they don't like it. And they also replied him, you understand? I really love this man. I would love to go to his church. I know love him. Whenever I ball in Ninja, I want to go to this man's church because he's real. To me, he's a real man of God that I've seen over years in Nigeria. He's saying the truth, he's exposing them. So let's react to I was told that one of them said that I have turned Christianity to a joke. That I said you can be sinning while listening to my sermons. People have turned Christianity to a joke. There's a preacher who said, don't worry yourself. Once you're born again, continue with your sin, but just keep on listening to Simon. The devil is a liar. No, sir. I never said that. You're quoting me out of context, and I know you're too intelligent to act in that manner. Somebody asked a question about addiction. And he said, if a man is addicted to porn and he comes to your church and wants to be free from porn, what should he do? And I said, he doesn't have to struggle with the porn. He should focus his attention on teaching because there's no amount of struggling that will free him from that porn. He has been struggling. That's why he came. So, but while he is still struggling with that pawn, he should focus more on the word of God because it is only the word of God that will break that addiction from his life. Because we all with open face, beholding the glory of God, where in a mirror we are changed from glory to glory, even as by the spirit of God. And you know, the good thing is that you can't really malign me in your churches anymore. Social media has made it very impossible for you because even while you're cutting me out of context in your pulpit, your members who follow me know that you're lying, sir. Please, please maintain your honor and don't disrespect your status because I never said that. Am I communicating at all? And secondly, it say, says we have turned Christianity into a joke. People have turned Christianity to a joke. <laughs> that's a laugh we turn christianity into a joke some of you said if you don't pay tight you will not make heaven you didn't turn christianity to a mockery and a joke anyone who is not paying his tight is not going to heaven full stop when you reduce the entire work of christ to mammon that a man can pay tight and he has entered heaven you are not turning christianity to more than a joke you said job didn't pay tight, that's why he suffered for nine months. Don't find anywhere where Job tight. No. He was overly committed to giving liberally to the poor. And God is committed to blessing him, but there was no security. Woo! Giving to the poor, to the poor, not to the church. Let's take that back. Let's see. No. He was overly committed to giving liberally to the poor. And God is committed to blessing him, but there was no security. Woo! Hallelujah. And we didn't find where he paid tight. That's why he was free from suffering. And that is not a joke. Casting as passion on the finished work of Christ. And some of you accuse us of giving people a license to sin. But in your own denomination, some of you am aware that some of your pastors teamed up and poisoned the G.O. of that church. Even while they were sitting under your hot holiness teachings, they were able to gang up and give you poison. And you say we are teaching people to sin? Some of you in your churches, your pastors are married to two wives under your holiness teachings. Is it our teachings they had to marry two wives and still be pastor in your churches? In Christianity, we do not preach sinless perfection. We preach Christ's perfection. Christ is more than enough. Nobody will make it by his efforts. And until you subscribe to Christ, you will keep traveling to heaven and never arrive. We are traveling together to heaven. Heaven is not a journey. 
Heaven is the believer's reality in Christ now. Glory to God. Some of you are just looking at me. I'm still teaching. It's just that I have different audiences in my services. So I make sure everybody is properly served. It's a global congregation. So we have to serve dinner to everybody. At last, at last, everybody will collect. <laughs> and everybody is collecting, Abby. Uh, you have to collect. They are collecting, bro, because they don't like it, you know. They are collecting for real. The word of God is for everybody. <laughs> Heesh. Glory to God. I say, glory to God. Huh? You know, I'm flattered. I'm flattered. I'm very blessed to know that a lot of you who critique me who sometimes attack my presence, you are privately listening to me. Yeah, and I'm, I'm flattered. And I'm grateful. Just one more advice, sir. Please listen very carefully. Listen very prayerfully and be calming down when listening. Listen not to attack, but listen to understand. That is definitely true, bro. Those who are attacking him, they are listening to his, to his message, you know. They don't like it. They sit down, listen to his message. They don't like it, you know. And they are bringing negative narrative, which everybody knows. Everyone knows about it, bro. Like, this man is a real man of God. He is a real man of God. But for what I've watched, he's a real man of God. He's exposing them and they don't like it. You feel me? What's your opinion? Drop it in the comment section. The two handles, YouTube, Facebook. Follow me in those two. Stay blessed, we'll take care, and I'll see you guys later. God loves you. Bye bye. Black and white Asians. We are one. Black and white Asians, we are one. Yeah.